Shostakovich had been commissioned at very short notice to write this incredible film, music, which took him about three weeks to compose. In fact, he said, I can do it in less than three weeks. The theme of the Paris Commune of 1871 was a very a uh, special theme for the Russian people. It was one of the first manifestation of, of any sort of uh, communist organization in any country. It was so important to them that when Lenin was buried, his uh, coffin was actually draped in a flag from the Paris Commune of 1871. <laughs> assumed that Shostakovich's first performance would have been using a large string section. Having seen the cinemas where it was first performed and for other uh, mm -hmm. reasons, we now know for certain that he didn't have an orchestra of more than 14 players. The music was put away and forgotten about and actually appeared in Shostakovich's catalogue of his own personal works as Opus 18, New Babylon, manuscript lost. And it disappeared for many, many years until Marius Constant did the first modern performance after Rostislavski unearthed the manuscript and did his famous concert suite. Not until 1975, just after the composer's death. We are now making a brave attempt to fit it as originally planned by Shostakovich, as far as we can, with the original scoring and for the recording we're going to be making for a CD, we have now found the music which goes with the original ending of the film. The film script still exists for this pacifist ending, but the music is beautifully horrible and morbid in a way that he was only to write again in his 1960s uh, style. I hope you enjoy the performance.